cooked all that good fish. Mm, mm, mm. Welcome back to Kiki Likes to Eat. Today I have some beer tacos. I know you guys can't really see. I'm just gonna be holding them up like this. Um, yeah, so before we get started, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you like more videos. Um, yeah, make sure y'all do that. All right, y'all, so today, whew, I'm doing a little car bang because I know I haven't really been doing um, mukbang videos like that so i'm gonna say great so get started. bless this food in jesus name i pray amen i feel rushed i hate that feeling Ooh. all right <laughs> so i feel a little rushed today but it's it's all good um i'm gonna eat a little Beer tacos, I'm stressful eating because I'm stressed out. I don't know, work has just been stressing me out. I need I need a vacation. That's what I really need. And so I just was like, oh man, like I just was really feeling it today. Right? And so then now I'm doing all I'm doing is just squeezing. I know y'all wanna see. Make sure I'm all spoon right here. Squeezing the lemons. All right, so, um, so yeah, I just was at work, stressed out, and I was like, okay, well, you know, I'm gonna eat something. So I said, might as well do a car bang. You know, I haven't done those in a while, and I told myself that I really like it. So, um, yeah. What happened to my napkin? Okay. And so, um. So work is done and I'm like, ooh, yes. Thank you, Jesus. I'm finished with work. And I come out to my little car. And someone hit my car, y'all. Someone hit the front of my um panel of my car right in front of my rim. Not right, yeah, right in front of my rim. It's like, why would someone do something like that? So I was just like in disbelief. Like I just can't believe. I'm gonna show y'all a video of my car because I'm just like really in disbelief. Look at all that good fish. These have been my favorite tacos for like ever, ever since I tried them. I cannot stop eating these tacos. I have a problem. So yeah, I'm gonna show y'all what my car, my little babe looks like. All right, y'all, uh, here's my little dirty baby. <clears throat> and this is the damage. And it looks like, I don't know, y'all help me out here. It looks like it's a white car, I don't know. God. Come on, son. They did me dirty. They did me dirty. So good. This is making it feel better. This is making me feel better about it. Oh 
So I come out and I see that my car has been hit. And it's like a big damage. I feel like I'm driving around with a hoopty now. But thankfully, thank God that I can drive my car. But um, what else? But then we did have a we did have a um a, a snowstorm for two days from Monday and Tuesday. And you know, if I don't go to the grocery store, I didn't want to be out driving in the weather because nobody knows how to drive in the snow. So I was like, I'm not going anywhere. And then because of quarantine, I don't really drive my car like that. I'll drive my car like maybe twice a week. And so, you know, it's been out there for two days. I haven't seen it. And I always check my car because I'm always like afraid. I have gotten my car broken into. So I always like fear like something's going to happen to it. So I always check my car before I get into it. You can tell by that window, it's a little dirty because of the snow. But, um, but yeah, so, um, what else happened? So, yeah, so it's like damaged and it looks like it has like some white streaks on it. So, I don't know if it was a white car that hit, um, my car, but it's so weird. Like, how it's like, how I don't even know how they would have hit it. But, and I'm like, kind of like, you know, questioning myself. I'm like, well, did I hit something? I didn't hit nothing. Did I hit something? No, because the way the damage is, it's like, it's crazy. It's crazy. Um, so I started walking around the neighborhood to see if someone has matching damage as mine. But I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait until nighttime to see because I was like come on now this is my neighborhood this is you know where I live and I'm pretty sure this is where you live too sure sure y'all see it <laughs> it was like I get angry because <laughs> I'm talking about my car and then I get happy because I'm eating tacos <laughs> So, so I just feel like I just I feel like I'm always losing faith in humanity because it's like okay we live in the same neighborhood you're not gonna leave a note or just even if we didn't live in the same neighborhood you're not gonna you're not gonna leave a note or you're just gonna do a hit and run I'm like, okay. and I always get into this like mood I'm like I work hard for my stuff so but it's okay. My mama called me after I showed her pictures and she was like, it's just material things. You should be blessed that it could have been worse. My mom always makes me feel better. Thank you, mommy. I'm so angry though. She was like, you better not be checking people's car late at night because someone might try to rob you or hem you up. I'm taking. And they're probably gonna park their little car somewhere far. And the only thing that's bad though about my my neighborhood is that um it's a big it's a big complex. Like it's so many um it's like a big complex. So um I'm going to have to, um, you know, just do some investigating. That's all. So, I wish I had a clear, a clear, uh, bowl. That's all right.
So now I have to file a police report. And um, I already called my insurance. They said that I have to pay like a 250 deductible, which isn't that bad. $250, you know what I can do? $250? It's not that bad. It could have been a thousand or worse. But, um, so I'm grateful for that. Somebody got some explaining to do. Oh, well, them tacos are good. Tacos made my day. This is so good. It's like they give you so much meat in here. I eat it the next day. It's so good. I hope the sun is not really bothering you guys. I'm sorry. Mm, don't really hope. <clears throat> it's kind of annoying. But, um, yeah, so that's what's going on in my life. Just gonna have a nice one or two beverage. Ugh, excuse me. One or two alcohol beverages and call it a day. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. I think that's about it. That's all I got going on. Someone just hit my car. So, yay. Mm. But yeah, so we had um a snowstorm on Monday. And it was really bad. I'm going to show y'all a picture of that too. I don't know if I have a video of it, but it was really um serious. Like, I didn't go outside. I was like, I'm not going anywhere. Two whole days. And the snow finally melt yesterday. And today was a good day to go outside. So it's like, it's cold in the shade, but it's hot in the sun, so. I'll, um, I put a sweatshirt on thinking that it's like um, cold outside and then walk outside it's hot so um, I just never know with this weather with this weather hmm tacos are so good but there's always something happening to my car it's always I feel like I don't know, these past couple of years, my car has just been going through it, going through it. Like, what happened? I want to say, like, a week or two, two weeks ago, my car stalled out for some reason, and then it had to get an update. They're like, oh, we don't know what's wrong with it, you know, we can charge you $300 for a tune-up, or, and I'm like, I'm not doing all that. So, they updated it. I haven't had any trouble since. Um, car got broken into... Um, I want to say a couple years ago, the steering wheel locked up, stopped working. They had to get me a new uh, steering wheel, and thank God that it was still under warranty. So I didn't have to pay for anything, but now, like, if something like that were to happen, I would have to pay, like, a lot of money, and it's just, like, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. I have an Optima Kia 2015. I like Kias. I wouldn't buy it again, and if I were you, don't ever buy that car, ever. Cause there's just so many, so many issues. I'm like, I this car is still fairly new for it to be having too many issues, and um, something else happened to this car. I feel like something else happened to this car. No, that's about it. Oh well, I'm almost done paying it off, so 
and I'm afraid because it's like everyone that I've talked to that have paid that has paid their car off something happens like they get into an accident it's totaled or someone steals it and it's gone for good so that's like that's like like you know in the back of my head but we'll see you know you just gotta pray about these things so you know in hindsight i feel a lot better i'm not stressed anymore at the moment so that's good i'm not stressed right now and i'm gonna find the person who did who hit my car <laughs> Oh, I'm pressing charges. I'm pressing charges. I'm pressing charges. I'm not even going. At first, I was like angry, but not like in a confrontational way. Like, oh, if I find this person, I'm gonna go off on them and, and this and that. I'm just gonna be like, insurance. Give me your insurance. Give me your insurance. That's it. Call the police. Give Give me your insurance. Not nice person. Hmm. Well, thank you guys for listening to me rant because it was a doozy. If you like this video, please go ahead, give it a like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in my next one, okay? Bye, guys.